Cooking with Crystal. Cooking with Crystal. Cooking with Crystal. Welcome, welcome back to Cooking with Crystal. Today, we're going to be doing another juice. We're going to be doing some apple lemonade with a hint of ginger. And here are our ingredients. We have the star of the show, Granny Smith Apple. Gala apples. We have our lemons and our fresh ginger. And these are our beautiful ingredients. Simple, but beautiful. We're gonna start off with the Gala Apple. The Gala Apple has vitamin A, C, and K. Vitamin C supports our immune system. Vitamin A promotes healthy vision. Vitamin K is important to blood clotting and bone health. Now when it comes down to the Granny Smith apple, they also have vitamin A, vitamin C, and potassium as well, which is vitamin K. The vitamin K is important because it helps maintain fluid and electrolyte balance both inside and outside the cell. It's no wonder why they say an apple a day helps keep the doctor away. I am a firm believer in that because whenever I eat an apple, I always feel better. This is how you want your cubes to look. And then we, of course, cut up our green apples. And now we're going to work on our lemons. Now, lemons are also high in vitamin C. So, Vitamin C is just very important for your body. The lemons also help your body make collagen for your skin. It also helps your body absorb iron and support your immune system. So we definitely need lemons as well. Now, once we finish cutting the peel off the lemon, we're going to go straight to peeling our ginger. Now, the best way to peel ginger is with a spoon. It's so easy to get that skin off with a spoon. You don't have to worry about cutting yourself with a knife. This is the easiest way to get this skin off. Now with ginger, it's really good to incorporate ginger in your diet around that time of the month. It relieves menstrual cramps. It lowers blood pressure. It improves blood circulation. It fights colds and flu. It relieves toothaches. It helps relieve digestive issues. So ginger is definitely something wonderful to have in your body. Now once we get the skin off of the ginger, we're just going to cut it into little pieces making it easy just to incorporate it into our delicious apple lemonade. Now with the knife, by na now with the angles, I would find it difficult cutting this with a knife. But with the spoon, it's just so easy to get this skin off.
Okay, and there you go. Nice and clean. And this is how you will cut it. And look at our beautiful ingredients. Simple, but beautiful. Those little pieces of apple is going to taste so good in our lemonade. Now let's get them ready to juice. We're going to put the lemons in first. And as you see, I have seven small lemons. They were very little. So I went on and I used seven lemons. because you don't want the lemons to take over the taste of apple. But this don't taste like apple juice. It actually tastes like an apple lemonade. Let's get our pitcher out. Now it was really important to me to Sweeten it up with another apple. Now, the gala apples, they're very sweet. I just did not want to put sugar in our lemonade today. If I can avoid it, I will. I'm learning to cut the juicer off first on some of the fruit because it makes it easier. Just cut the juicer off, fill the cavity, and then turn it back on. And this smells so good. Doing the juices makes me appreciate fruit and vegetables a whole lot more because I used to go to the market and wonder why is this juice so expensive? I see why the juice is expensive now, but for some reason their juice do not taste as good as when you make the juice yourself. You see, I could have cut that piece up a little smaller because it wouldn't fit in there. But this is the star right here, the Granny Smith apples. I, the tartiness of the Granny Smith apple is going to pair so well with the lemon. And then the sweetness of the gala Apple would just balance it right out. Now I did have to switch pictures because this picture was way too big. I just did not have enough fruit for it. And then we're just going to put our little bit of ginger in. I always get nervous putting ginger in anything because I love ginger a lot. But my husband cannot stand ginger. And he got my granddaughter not liking it too. But they're not even going to be able to taste it. And if you notice, it doesn't really make a lot. So it's just a pop. Of ginger. Now try not to waste any of the juice like I'm doing here. This couple of drips. Try to catch those and use them. Okay, now I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this in a different picture. But look at that beautiful color. Oh it just looks so good. Now we're just going to add our cubed apples. 
and let's give it a stir. This looks really pretty. The color is gorgeous. Just looking for the opening so I can pour me some. That is such a pretty color. Mmm. And it smells so apple-y. Mmm, it smells so good. Look at that. And here we go. Apple lemonade with a hint of ginger. Mm. That is so refreshing. And it's good. It just... It's so good. Mm. Now put the little teeny apples in it to cleanse your palate as you're drinking it. Mm. This is so good. You taste the apple. Now the reason why I use the red apples is to give it the sweetness because we don't want to use sugar. But the star is the Granny Smith apple because the sourness of the Granny Smith pairs so well with the lemon. And then you have your Gala apples giving it the sweetness that it needs. But this is not real sweet lemonade, but it's not real tarty either it is perfect definitely try this juice i've been bringing juices because it is cold season and all these juices have a lot of healing properties and we need natural healing we don't need to have to get a prescription for every thing that's wrong with us because some of the things we can heal on our own mm. that is so good that is so good now my husband hates and ginger and so do my little top which is my granddaughter she hates ginger too. They're not going to be able to even know it's ginger in here. Because we like ginger. Oh, yeah, our body loves ginger. Mm. And y'all, try this recipe. This recipe is a really good one. Like and subscribe to my channel. I am Crystal Holiday. And as always, as always, be. Bless. Like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Be blessed.